Happy Fourth of July, my American viewers. And we make gravestone. Cream key here. I thought that one one thing. I can't think of one thing. When I was thinking for a Fourth of July one episode, I got thinking I thought discontinued fast food food. How well are you guys the Fourth of July? On this shirt that says Freedom Call. So let's not talk about one. Here are some top 10 discontinued fast food items. Number 10 is Szechuan sauce. I read it last as, as a sauce, and well, it's not very American. So. So. What? So bad? So what about it? And also, if, if I didn't include this one, a lot of you might have. I had some angry comments about it. So, it was actually to promote the movie Mulan. And the reason people want back is because, well, because of Rick and Morty, Rick and Morty, Rick and Morty, Rick and Morty, Rick and Morty. Rick and Morty. <laughs> well, yes. Yeah, because, well, yeah, because Rick and Morty fans just want from a movie based on a company that I think is going to be very evil. But, I'm guessing if they want to be a man, they'll need to keep commenting for this Szechuan sauce. <laughs> yeah. Number 9 is the Yumbo. Yeah, the Yumbo is pretty much a 70's Burger King item. So, What's so basically about it? It started in the 70s. It got a revival like in 2014 for the $5 menu, and it didn't last that long either there. But it had a less weirder commercial than that. Than that move. Just one sauce commercial of that fast food I mentioned also. Right, yeah, well, let's see, but well, for us, let's see if Burger King will make it, let's see if we will yumbo again. <laughs> now, the next thing, now ne number eight is pretty much what I'm thinking of, I'm going to think of the Mick Africa. Now, I know it's supposed to be American, but I had to add this one because, well, this because of its controversial origin. Here's something. It contains make Africa actually have many exotic African tastes. It was supposed to support the Olympics, but unfortunately, at the time when it was being served, Africa was dealing with a huge horse food shortage. It's still one of its Olympic thing. But we'll see if we can see but let's see if it can get. Let's see if. Let's see if it will make Africa back. Okay. Next one is. There's this one called. Next up is another mix one, mixed hot dogs. These ones, unfortunately, the founder. Ban hot dogs because well they look weird. So guess what? But after his death, they decided to do let's make the hot dog thing. Now here's something. It tasted like me to yucky, but people didn't like it. It was discontinuing your premise quickly. Yes. But let's see. But with fan, but with nostalgia being likely, let's see. Let's see if this if they bring it back. Let's see if it'll be a. Hot dog. <laughs> yes. Come at, at number six is the. It's another Mc one is the Mc Pizza. Okay, a lot of you probably gonna make McDonald's as well. They have a lot of discontinued stuff. Number four is the Mc Pizza. Now. When you think of McDonald's, you think of burgers or or that fish patty that tastes 
or that fish patty that I don't know what it's made out of. But, for this one, but the reason why it was discontinued is, unlike their more fast cycles, likely it took long. Yeah, well for this one I was thinking, it was about time McDonald's had more quality in their food. Like really, Taco John's actually has a lot more for their menu, and they actually look pretty much, they look very close to the ad. Unlike, well, McDonald's is kind of like that. But, there's just a rumor that there's a store in, I don't know, like some state, some state. next one, up to number five, is another, it's another movie tie-in, but this one isn't from a Disney movie, it's from Universal, it's from Disney's rival, Universal. It's from Dairy Queen. Now, Dairy Queen still counts fast food, since they have many kind of iconic fast food chains, like the Flamethrower Cheeseburger. This is known as, if you guessed it, it's the, it's the, it's the Jurassic Park Blizzard. Well, but to promote Jurassic World, which was the spin-off series of Jurassic Park, the Spark franchise, they did many. Dairy Queen did a thing which had peanut butter cookies mixed with chocolate chip cookie dough, which sounds really yummy. Yummy, so good, so good. I would have tried it, but unfortunately, I didn't live nearby a a Dairy Queen. Now, from like nowadays. But, but it tastes so good. It was discontinued because, well, it was Italian. Number four is. are pretty much. I'm thinking right now. What's this? Oh, wait. How about that? Burger King? How about that? Next one is Taco John's Spicy Cheeto Burrito. Now, this one was released in 2014 with, well, something. Here's something. Two things I like. Spicy and Cheetos. So, you make those two again? Got these. They were only allowed for a short time. Like, I don't know, like some limited time frame? They didn't say that. I actually took a taste of it, and it was spicy. Like, really. The Taco Jones I actually went to actually didn't have the one ones that didn't allow refills. Really? Of course, yeah, I couldn't even finish it without even drinking a little less. Like this. And I would like to sit one day. Number two is Taco Bell Kids News. Now, these were released during a time. Taco Bell were discontinued their kids meals in 2013. In case you guys are well new with fast food for its kids meals, Taco Bell had many wacky toys. I didn't even know they even had licenses to them. The ones I got were were just random stuff I never even heard of. Like some but their even advertisement of the kids meal toys or even the actual ones. But sometimes they were pretty much better than likely. The reason I talk about this continuum wasn't because of because of well, it was because it was too cheap. You gotta realize it. According to what you got you gotta talk about those tw cinnamon twists and a fruit punch. I got a soda when I got those, like, I don't know, like, I guess it's from different regions. Yeah. Well, I'm guessing this one will not. But many health groups actually think of it kids not going fast. Uh, well, well, children, you know you don't really always need a toy for your kids' meals. You know you can eat the food. Also, hey, you can make a pop it out of those eggs. Like, Dairy Queen doesn't have toys. Okay, News 2 has toys, but I don't think they do them now. Yeah. 
I'm gonna have a number one. Number one. Now, number one, what do Americans. This next one is pretty much your neutral. Okay, then. Oh, geez. Oh, my God. Oh! was leaking. So my iPad was leaking, so yeah. So Apple mentions Starbucks's Unicorn Frappe Chino. Why is an addict as well if you drink? Also it's also I would have made too much also I would have talked a lot too much about Unique, which a lot of you are probably getting headaches about that one. About me talking about that. So I'll try it step. And uh and uh mixed salad shakers as those are pretty much. So number one is the volcano taco. What is that? During the late two thousands, the volcano taco was this weird spicy taco that was very it was around served sometime, but unfortunately due to the popular of the spicy Feels Locos Taco, you, it was discontinued because of that. So, so, what about it? I think it would be a great idea to have a Volcano Taco, as I would like to sell that. Also, it's because, well, I don't know, I don't know, it would be a great idea. I don't know. <laughs> and yes, they discontinued, now, yeah. Number one is from a company that, that gives birth to diarrhea. That probably gave birth to diarrhea. <laughs> yeah, of course it was very inventive to them. But, well, I don't know if he'll come back. That's all. That's all. Don't forget to like and or leave a comment. Also, also, it, also if you want me to do a part two of this, I'll be glad to. I'll be glad to do it. And bye-bye.